let's talk about the Theta blockchain. The Theta blockchain is a dual coin blockchain. There are two coins. One is called Theta token and the other is called Theta fuel or T fuel. The Theta token is the main token. You can't earn Theta tokens. You can only buy Theta tokens. What can you do with the Theta token? Well, you can buy and hold them and potentially profit when the value of those go up over time. You can run a Guardian node by staking them and earn Theta T fuel tokens. Think of it as earning interest on your investment in Theta tokens. You currently to stake and run a guardian node you need a minimum of 10,000 theta tokens which as of this recording would cost you uh, they're about 66 cent a piece so you're talking $6,600 to uh, purchase enough to be able to run a guardian node what is tfuel tfuel is the operational token on the theta blockchain it is the token that acts as currency in the Theta blockchain. You can earn T-Fuel in a number of ways. By watching videos on Theta.tv is one way. By running an edge node, you just go to the ThetaToken.org site and scroll down and download the edge node software. And the other way would be to run a guardian node, but you have to have 10,000 Theta tokens in order to do that. And I've been doing that for about a month or so, and I'm earning right around 12, 12 and a half T-Fuel uh, a day doing that. Why will the Theta token go up in value? There are only 1 billion Theta tokens. There will never be any more. Because many of the owners of Theta tokens will stake them in order to earn T-Fuel. These Theta tokens are in essence locked up. Thereby reducing the number of Theta tokens available for purchase. Many owners of Theta will not have enough to run a Guardian node. So they are just holding on to them to hopefully make a profit when the price of the Theta tokens go up. There has been a rumor floating around that Theta Labs may reduce the number of Theta required to run a Guardian node from the current 10,000 down to 1,000 in the hopes that they'll be able to increase the number of Guardian nodes running. But uh, I haven't heard anything official on that yet. Based on what I'm earning for staking 10,000, if they do reduce it to 1,000 Theta, you would earn basically a tenth of that or about one T-Fuel per day, maybe a little bit over that, but uh, I kind of hope that they do reduce it, but I guess we'll see. What will drive the price of T-Fuel? Well, T-Fuel being the operational token will be in demand as various entities will need to purchase them for use within the Thetaverse. Advertisers who want to advertise on videos will need to buy them to pay T-Fuel to the viewers who watch their ads. Content producers who want to use the Theta Network as a distribution mechanism will need to purchase to pay consumers of the video content. With the dual coin system, what we have is we have um, nothing but pressure. We have the motivation to lock up Theta. Theta's yeah. job is to lock up and secure the network. Well, in, in a lot of POS systems, you get rewarded in that same coin. Well, so there's a inflation rate that needs to be a, a, attached to that, and then there can be downward pressure. So if people want to take profits in, a, in another coin, and the coin pays its rewards in that same coin, there's some downward pressure on the market to sell to get your profits. With a, two, a dual coin system like Theta has, you can have downward pressure for profit taking um, absorbed and completely taken away from Theta. So Theta really has exponential upward pressure that I can't see except for people exiting their position. And you're going to have to take into consideration people are exiting their position and they're saying, I 
don't want to get 20 more years of T fuel rewards on this. So it's not that you're just selling your theta position, you're selling all that fruit that that tree would bear too. Um, so I guess that, that, you know, then you have, well, now we've got a, a second coin with all downward pressure. Well, but then that's where the platforms come in, where they're going to then buy because they're going to need to use that as the use case, that T-Fuel. So Theta has a use case, and that's securing the network, and T-Fuel has a use case. And both have upward buy pressure capability. Yeah, and then you've also got all the speculators who got a ton of T-Fuel for free. He's talking about all the people that bought Theta early on when it was still on the Ethereum blockchain, and when the mainnet blockchain went live, they got an airdrop uh, five to one T fuel for every theta that they owned at that point. I benefited from that, and so, you know, those were essentially free. Who were saying, "Hey, I got this free coin. It's not worth too much today, but I'm holding on to that." So now, what they're doing, in essence, without getting a reward, is their their T fuel is somewhat staked, so it's in their wallet waiting on price discovery. And uh, I'll just tell you this: most of my viewers here know this. And this is where he's going to talk about the Wall Street analysts and what they're saying about the future price of T-Fuel, where it's going to go. Interesting. And uh, I've got one group on Wall Street that I talk with. It's very, very, very involved intimately on the inside with Theta. They've given me two targets on Theta Fuel, one for early 2021 of around $5. And they've given me a $60 target by 2022 on Theta Fuel. And they even went on to say to me, that's probably about the most you'll ever see out of Theta Fuel because things will stabilize as crypto stabilizes. And so anyway, take it for what you want. I don't ever take things that people tell me, no matter how close they are to a project and go, okay, this is it. I'm stamping it in stone. This is how it has to be, but just take that for what you will. And um, yeah, just add it to your kind of to your, your, your notes. Sure. Sure. I, um, yeah, I, I, I can see those prices being um, quite realistic. So let's say uh, early on when it was still only $0.10 cents and it was on the Ethereum network at that point, you uh, saw the uh, genius of the Theta network and the concept behind it, and uh, you bought 2500 of them at $0.10 cents a piece, total cost of about 250 bucks, and uh, you just sat on them. Well, those 2500 when they launched the main net, you got that airdrop of 5 to 1 T fuel, uh, you ended up with 12,500 T fuel, and at the current time, those things are worth uh, right around a penny. And so, if uh, what these Wall Street analysts believe the price will be in early 2021 of say five dollars, that 12,500 T fuel that you've been sitting on and you got for free will be worth a considerable amount of money. Uh, what about sixty thousand dollars, maybe something like that. Take this a little further, if you had the uh, foresight of buying a total of 10,000 uh, Theta so that you could stake them, you would be earning about 12 a day of uh, T-Fuel, which per month would be like 360, I think, and uh, multiply that times $5 every month. That's about $1,800 a month in income that you'd be receiving based on a price of 5 dollars per uh, t fuel token not a bad uh, return on your investment if you enjoyed this video please like it share it and most importantly hit that subscribe button thanks for watching